Hi everyone, I'm doing a what's in my bag since I got a lot of requests for it. So here I got a urban gray case and I got some signatures on it that we'll be talking about. First, here I have my Bitmoji holographic and then I also have this card that someone gifted me for my birthday, so thank you. And here we have a bunch of signatures even on the back. So first, I got Shane Van Boning's signature, and then I got Jeanette the Black Widow's signature, and then I got Sky Woodward's signature, and then on the back here, I got one of the funniest guys in pools, Alex Pagline. <laughs> So that is what on the outside of my bag is. Now let's check the inside out. So first, I'm gonna go in with my black 4-5 key. Admire it. And then I got my Predator Z3 shaft, as you can see. And then for some conditions, I use the Predator Revo 12.9 shaft, millimeter. Okay, so that's my playing cue, and then I also have a backup, one that I use out of state, that's the P3, and it comes with a Revo 12.4 shaft, so. And then, my next uh, equipment is the BK Rush in blue, with a sport wrap, as you can see. Probably one of the best brick keys you can get on the market right now. And then also that comes with the shaft, obviously. And then I got my Air Rush with a sport grip right here. It jumps very well. It's just like effortlessly you can get over a ball with it. And then obviously it comes with a Air Rush shaft. And I've almost forgot to talk about the tip. So on the tip of my Z3, I have a Tom Medium Pro, or Pro tip, yeah. And then on my, uh, on this 12.9, I got the stock tip from Predator, right here. And then on my brake cue for my BK Rush, I have a yellow, break jump tip from Tom. And then lastly, I have a Predator stock tip right here too for the jump, which is wonderful by the way. All the tips I have on there are just great. Oh yeah, and then now I'm gonna zip this up. And first, I got a Predator towel to wipe down my shafts or clean my hands. And then I have a Predator glove. I have a couple of these, actually. I have a bunch of boxes of them. Uh, I actually have another Predator glove, and this is their latest one, or one of their latest ones. Two of my favorite colors. And then next, I have my weight bolt kit right here. So it has all the stuff in there. All my weights in there I need for my playing cue, my break cue, anything. Next, we have some Tom Shock. I have V10 and Pyro I use, and then, so I have a lot of extra since sometimes I lose it. Um, and I'll put that there. Then I have my uh, tip shaper. So most of the time I use the pick. It breaks down into a bunch of pieces. And just screw that on. Next, I have a Sharpie just in case I want any signatures. So that always comes in handy or anything. Then I have this Predator uh, cue holder so it can transform into anything. It could go, goes on the table and then you could just put it any way. Even on circle tables, you can like bend it like that or whatever. So it comes in handy a lot. I'll put it here. And then I have two extensions. I have a 12 inch extension and I have an eight inch extension. And they, I believe they also sell four inch extensions. 
So I, I put my name on it, or my mom made my, uh, my name on it, Roadrunner and Savannah, because I lose it a lot. <laughs> then, let's see, I have a whole bag of patches for my sponsors. So you can see that's pretty thick. Then I have a magic eraser for my uh, all my shafts. It really helps clean them. And I believe, oh wait no, at the BCA Predator gave me a hand sanitizer, so they make hand sanitizers. And then last but not least, I have some of the Revo wipes to wipe your shafts. These work incredible, so they can get all chalk off or whatever. So that's my whole what's in my bag and you can go to roadrunnerindustries.com for all of these products. I want to thank all my sponsors for giving me all these equipment and then I also for home practicing I use these Predator, Predator Arco Predator balls and then also I have this beautiful Predator Arena light. and. Mine comes with all different settings, so I can change colors, change the brightness, and it's just wonderful, probably one of the best lights. So I want to thank everyone for watching. Peace out.